Unless it's a farm! Alright, ladies and gentlemen, as uh, we get things finally settled here, uh, thank you for joining us here at EREV TV as we're going to have the lower bracket finals here for the Godfrag tournament. Uh, this is going to be Pierre going up against the dismantled and uh, put together by Bubblegum and Glue X3O. As uh, I will be casting by myself, at least in this map, um, Just Out of Water will be uh, casting the next map once we go transition to the second one. So uh, over the starting laps, here we go. Uh, the knife round has already taken place here. So the first round will be in just a second once our video guy gets ready up. But in the meantime, for the defense, we have X3O. We have Mav, Insight, Grim, Apostle, the return of Mr. SMG himself, and Freak. And I believe that's probably Twister more than likely, but I'm not 100%. For the attack side, we have the usual cast of characters for Pierre. We have Snatch, Glad, Deli, Coach, and of course, Limitless. So uh, that is the attack side of Pierre. Defense again is X3O. Uh, things are going to get started here on MP Vacant. And uh, away we go. So uh, right now we're going to take a look here at uh, Snatch. Now he has the bomb here. Oh, he gets taken out very easily there by Mav. So the Mav is on the, or excuse me, the bomb is on the outside dumpster here. As it uh, looks like Pierre is going to have to come back and uh, get that. x all looking very good right now. They have all five members alive and kicking. Gladiator taking out uh, Twister there. So uh, there goes, oh, we have uh, Grim taking our coach. So back and forth they go here as Mav is working the uh, graffiti hallway. We have Insight right now. Oh, he just blasted Deli in the courtyard right there with the shoddy one to zero. X3-0 uh, on the board early here, one to zero. So I'm going to take a look here off the start. And uh, maybe let's take a look at Mav here as uh, he's going to be working the A bomb side. It looks like with... Uh, uh, possibly looks like Apostle here. So they're going to try to hold down the A bomb site as he's making his way. Yes, it is Apostle. Oh, he gets taken out by, oh, Gladiator with a double kill there. Rocking the 74. Gladiator now picking up the trifecta on the rusty Apostle. Gladiator doing some work here in the second round right now as Snatch and Deli pick up the last two kills there. A nice little uh, team ace there from Pierre coming out of the gates in the second round very fast there. So it is all tied up here early off in the first map of the Scott Frag lower bracket finals here. Again, between Pierre and X3O. And in case you didn't know or uh, didn't hear the latest and greatest, as you know, Juvie left X3O and he took uh, Syntax and uh, with him over to Mob Gaming. So this is why we have the uh, broken up uh, roster here of X3O, the return of Apostle. So he's been rusty as of late. As I looked at a, a screenshot in the SIBO match when they played uh, Mob, uh, not too well there from uh, from the man Apostle. I believe he was 7 and 20. And oof, that is not the Apostle I used to know. But again, he's a little rusty playing that WoW and doing his other real life stuff. So hopefully he can turn that around here as Twista is the last one here for X3O. Uh, he's in the lead bomb site here, the uh, Soda Pop Machine. As uh, he moves away. Did I just say Soda Pop? I meant Coke Machine as I'm not from the Midwest. But anyway, some of you people out there know what I'm talking about. Uh, right now we have Twista working his way. 
Uh, again, it's Freak, as you see in the front uh, screen there, so I'm hoping it's Twist. I hope I don't feel stupid here by calling him that if it's not him. But anyway, he's in the kitchen area right now. He's getting fired upon here from Coach. Coach now uh, working very slowly. He has Delicious here. Delicious is going to get the plant down in the A of Bombsite. As shots Those are being fired here at Freak. Freak, no, nothing going here. He's just taking his time here. Coach really toying with him a little bit as 37 seconds here is working against Freak. And there it is. Coach cleans it up with the MP5. So it is now 2-1. to one. We're going to head to War Room right now. And we're going to do... Uh, let's go to x -Rio. Let's see what they're talking about uh, right now. Let's go there now, Mayday. x -Rio. He's, yo, he's tagged on that dog. He's tagged. Oh, come on. That a. Front A. He's in A. Uh, I'm gonna tag. Guess oh, coming on B. Oh, well, I'll try. I'm gonna get him if he comes. You have no range with that, bro. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we have Gladiator cleaned bad. up. That round is now extended to three to one. And Pierre, uh, just that that nonstop wrecking train uh, right now has left the station once again. So uh, let's take a look at Pierre here. As uh, again, three to one right now, still early off, but uh, extra having some uh, problems at least uh, from the from the get go here. They looked good in that first round, but as of late, they haven't really got the uh, the rounds obviously that they need. Let's take a look at Insight here. As uh, oh, he just. Uh, it's a uh, gladiator there inside with a double kill on limitless he is controlling the crappers area like no other here working past the bio cabinets and he's got grim as a backup he gets taken out by snatch with the ak so let's take a look at inside as he is the last man he's got the shoddy let's see here as he's just laying low here snatch with the bomb overlooking the courtyard let's take a look at inside it's going to be coach snatch going up against inside inside with the clutch goggles along with the pump the pump here oh he gets taken out by snatch very easily as he turned around that a graffiti hallway 4 to 1 now in the favor of pure all right we're gonna take a look once again uh, let's take a look here at Hey, let's take a look at Freak, which is AKA Twister here, as he's uh, gonna hold down the B bomb pad. I, I, actually, he's gonna go to the crapper area and hold down the mid. He gets blinded there, so uh, nobody's dead quite yet. Uh, in case you didn't know, uh, you can get your shoutouts across the airwaves at pound e rev on the Game Surge Network. You can hit up myself, Anger, or you can hit up definitely Just Add Water. Uh, sometime during the match, a break in this session, uh, we will definitely get those out to you as Limitless there takes out Apostle. Again, Apostle looking really rusty off the start here. Uh, Snatch with the bomb. Uh, he's going up against Mavin Insight. So 4v2 here. The uh, two-man advantage make that three-man advantage here going to appear as map gets taken out so let's Explosions take a look at insight planted. insight right now is uh, over the back portion or actually the incoming portion of the building on the a graffiti side as he's got 35 seconds working against them here he's going up against four members oh he takes out coach coach in the open there gets blasted by the pump shoddy but there's limitless to clean it up five to one now in the favor of pure we're gonna take a look at the e rev scoreboard right now we have insight eight and five we have Mav three and five and Grim coming in also at three and five for Pierre we have glad nine and three lighting up the board looking very sexy glad good job thus far we have snatch here five and three and coach Carter with the scope at five and two so right now let's take a look here as a gladiator it is just all over x3 freaking all right now as freak uh, gets taken out by snatch snatch is to plant the bomb in the B side here and the last person Apostle come in with the deep on Gladiator let's see what Apostle can do here no he does he gets taken out by Delhi with the 74 it is now six to one I was getting a little tingly there as Apostle was possibly uh, gonna clutch that up right now we're gonna go to Pierre's uh, war room Mayday let's go to Pierre Got one 
Nice try out there. I need to raise her. Back right, back right with a scope. Soda. Oh, couch. <laughs> wow! Apostle takes out Limitless with a scope. What? Oh my goodness! We're just gonna take a look at this, mate. I, I I cannot believe Apostle with a scope. This is just odd here. I'm gonna make sure I'm seeing the right thing here. Yes, he does have the scope off the start of the round here. Let's take a look here as uh, he tries to get a, a shot into the uh, offense. There, nothing going there. Apostle backs up, <laughs> being a little aggressive there with the with the uh, sniper rifle, pushing up forward, thinking he's an SMG or. A, but uh, nothing going there as Limitless now taking out Freak Grim uh, takes out Snatch, so away they go here. And Pierre has the uh, four against two. Two man advantage here for Pierre. Oh, Apostle taking out Limitless once again. We're going to take a look at Apostle here. Apostle gets taken out very easily there by Delicious as Gladiator now is working the beef on site. Matt, right now, last man standing. He gets taken out by Glad with the 74. It is now 7-2 to two here in the favor of Pure. And Pure right now is just really uh, cracking the whip here on X3O. And again, I'm not making any excuses for X3O, but again, they've gone through some uh, major changes and very quickly here as of late. In one week, they went from being a top three North American team to losing a lot of their players and, um, well, you have the core from the powerhouse days, so uh, they're reliving the powerhouse days, even though they're under the X3O tag. But, again, with the members they have, uh, let's see if they can bring that magic back. Uh, let's see what they can do here. Uh, right now, it is uh, the, all five for X3O going up against uh, four members of Pure, as Snatch has the bomb right now. He's trying to work, looks like, the B hallway uh, very, very slowly here. I'm not sure what's, what's freaking him out here. Uh, but uh, let's see what happens here as he's trying to work it very slowly. We have Gladiator now overlooking the A-bomb site. Shots being fired. Mav right now uh, also guarding the A-bomb site. Uh, we have Freak, a.k.a. Twister now, uh, holding off in the hallway. Inside, holding off the uh, crapper area uh, with the pump shotty. Mav with a double kill, taking out Glad and Limitless. And look at Mav uh, doing some work here at the A-bomb site. Delicious now from the courtyard trying to fire in at the crapper area. Nothing going there as Snatch and Deli, the, again, the last two here. Snatch with the bomb working slowly. Bomb, or actually the uh, smoke being deployed around the A-bomb site. 25 seconds working against him here. He's going to work slowly. Uh, Matt just laying off. He knows something's going to happen here as he's moved his position slightly here. Hopefully to see what Snatch does. Snatch really making a, a strong move here. Rotation with the help of Deli taking out Insight. Mav again with a trifecta taking out Snatch there. And Freak cleaning it up now. It is now 7-3. to three. And Mav, the key at least to that round, doing a nice job with three kills there. The trifecta from Mav. So a rare occurrence from Mav. But again, doing some work here and pulling his weight uh, thus far. So right now, oh, Coach taking out Apostle. Apostle, you cannot snipe against Coach. So Coach letting them know who the boss is on at least this map. Delhi taking out Mav. So again, 4v3 or 4v2 now as Insight gets taken out there. So the two-man advantage again going to Pierre, and Pierre has been enjoying this advantage here at least with two or three, and there it is, Limitless, uh, taking out Graham, and it is now eight to three. We're going to head right back to War Room, so let's go to X3 freaking O Mayday. All right, let's try it. Hold on, wait for our smokes, wait for this spam. There's the spam. Inside A, inside A. Got yeah, coach. Nice. Yeah, right side box. Right side. Just wait for him, guys. Someone watch bathroom. I'm in bathroom. That's That's outside on dock. Just leave him at the fucking hut. Just don't push him. I'm fine. Alright, now he's going to the tank. He's, he's by tank. tank. Alright, fuck him. Everyone go. Everyone go, let's go. Nading him. He's still there. Come on. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! No, get that. That's right. Apostle just takes out Limitless with a knife and it is now 8 to 4 as we hit the halftime marker here. 
And 8-4 to four is not bad, but on the defense, you need to pick that up at least a little bit more rounds there. So uh, Pierre is looking very juicy uh, with the 8-4 to four, uh, score here. Uh, right now, I'm going to get to some shout-outs. Uh, we, I just have a couple here early off. We have one from Joshua. Uh, shout out to all the ATL baddies. And by the way, get Cal back up so we can get raped in Maine some more. <laughs> so Josh, is, uh, Josh wants his anal cavity just spread open a little bit more. We have one here from Triple 20 from X3O. Twista is freak. Yes, I thought so. LOL. And also, uh, shout out to the Rusty AK. Uh, so that is uh, his shout out as I probably messed that up, uh, Trip 20 as I clicked out of it when I uh, PM'd you earlier, so I apologize as I screwed your, your shout out. But, you know, send it back to me and I'll get it out. So it looks like we're going to get things rocking and rolling here uh, for the second half. Again, again, like I was saying, like the last matches here, everybody's secretive about the maps being played, so I apologize for not knowing as, again, I'm going to have to talk to the uh, Secret Service or the uh, National Security NSA for what the next map is. But in the meantime, hope you guys are joining us here on Vacant. This is the Godfrag Lower Bracket Finals brought to you by EREP. And of course, Axis Solutions. Make sure you head on over, perform an idol, pound Axis Pro. For, and uh, make sure you idle them. Make sure you check out Axis Solutions for all your server and voice needs. And uh, Coach taking out Apostle there. So uh, four before action here early off in the second half, uh, first round of the second half here. As right now we have Snatch getting lit up here, bleeding a little bit here, not too much. Gladiator now with a pump shotty. Uh, the pump shotty looking like the uh, weapon of choice here in the crappers area. So if you're in the crappers, uh, well, you got to have a pump shotty. So uh, you better use it well. And uh, thank you, Mayday, for reminding me. Axis-Pro.com. And uh, make sure you go there. It is now 9-4 to four as Pierre picks up once again another round. And uh, they're, again, looking good. Trying to put this away very quickly. And again, I'm not sure when the finals is going to be, but the winner of this one will take on Pandemic. And damn, Pandemic has had the longest round. Oh, my God. Apostle taking out Coach there with a nice shot. Nice, good job, Apostle. Uh, again, I was, uh, as I was stating, uh, I'm not sure when this match uh, for the finals will be taking place. Again, the winner of this one will be taking on Pandemic. Uh, Pandemic, uh, really, I, I don't really even know if they remember that they're in, still in this tournament. It's been so long since we've seen them uh, when they beat uh, X3O in the up, uh, upper bracket first portion finals there. But nevertheless, uh, they're still in this tournament, alive and kicking, and waiting for the winner of this one. So Limitless, the last man standing, going up against Mav. So who's going to win this as Mav has the bomb? He's rotating the B. Here comes Limitless now. Looks like he's going all the way uh, from mid to B, and he hears the jingle jingle. Mav giving the fake right now, trying to fake the funk a little bit. Nothing going there. Looks like Mav is going to rotate to A. Is this right? Wow, he's got 52 seconds, so he has time on his side, definitely. Limitless is taking a nap in the freaking hallway here that leads into the B. Mav rotating all the way to A. Limitless. The, the, the clock is taking 40 seconds working against him. He has not moved an inch. Oh, there he goes. He's moving now as Mav is going to get the plant down. Very smart play here from Mav. Uh, really faking Exposing out the Limitless. Planted. Now the pressure is on Limitless here. He has 42 seconds working against him. Mav now on the outside of the dock area. Limitless now. Look at his way. Gets shot at. Shots being fired from both ends. Here comes the uh, nerd nade. Can Limitless pull it off? As no, he can't. Oh, but he does take out Mav with an MP5 shot. And Limitless cleans up the round here, and he will get this defused. So good defused. job to Limitless there, uh, taking out Mav. So it is now 10 to 4 in the favor of Pure. We're going to go right back to Pure's War Room. Mayday, let's go. Rushing a hole. Flash in one. Watching it. They're scoping one to your left. Shotgun back left. He's in double double barrel or whatever. Shotty. Bombs Looks like they're both in a. Front door. I'm flanking around the back. So. Bombs in, uh, like, uh, doorway, side door of A. Not the bathroom side of A, uh, by flat. Nice. Last guy was in A. Nice job. Alrighty, 11-4 here as Pierre picks up again another round. 
And uh, Mayday, I have to say, people are loving the stream here. So you fixed your issues, at least on the network side. Of, and they're showing you some love on IRC. And they're, hitting, they're PM, PMing me. As that's a, try to say that freaking three times fast. PM, 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 PM. Uh, they're PMing me uh, about it. So good job uh, on that Mayday getting things locked up here. We're going to take a look at X3. Freaking oh here in the graffiti hallway as Mad now and along with Grim uh, trying to get some shots into the uh, hallway here as now inside they are bunched up together they are rotating to the B site and now it looks like it's going to be a full B push here Mav is leading the cause here oh Twister gets taken out by Deli Delicious is not having any of that let's take a look at Delicious with a double kill here on inside Delicious now uh, in between the hallways gets taken out by Mav as he flanks Grim now working slowly here uh, also into the B hallway there's Coach oh almost hit Grim Grim just peaked his uh, peaked a little bit there uh, Coach didn't pick it up Grim now going to lay the smoke mo he's going to lay the nail well, let's see what happens here as Coach takes out Grim, but Grim nades him there. So uh, those kills uh, pretty much neutralize one another. Here we have Mav now in the courtyard going up against Snatch. Snatch 2v1. Let's see what Snatch can do. It's Apostle again with the scope. Mav with the bomb. Let's see here what Snatch can do. Mav takes him out with a 74. And X3 freaking oh gets another round. It is now 11 to 5. We're going to take a look at the E-Rev scoreboard here. We have Limitless getting close to that 20 bomb status. He is 16 and 9. Gladiator 15 and 9. And Delicious 14 and 8. All three members there, the top three scores for Pierre looking sexy. We have X3, we have Matt 14 and 13. Inside 11 and 13. And Apostle uh, 10 and 13. Really struggling a little bit, but they're picking up the kills here in the second half. So. Uh, they're trying to get warmed up, trying to get into this match here. So i got to give them some love there. Again, uh, the roster just been a little raped there uh, as of late. So they're trying to work things out again. But uh, I'm sure they don't want any excuses here because they are a good, good team. And uh, right now we have Coach uh, with the scope here in the uh, A bomb site. It's going to be Mav Insight and Twister now. And here comes Coach. Coach getting taken out there by Mav. He's going to get the plant down. Insight kind of, uh, kind of gave himself up there. And Delicious gets taken out by Twister, so 11 to 6. X3 0 uh, with two rounds in a row here. Looking very, very good. Right now, we're going to head to X3 freaking 0 right now's War Room Mayday. Let's go. Actually, I'm going bathroom. This is a guy. Dude, they did something different this round. They did something different. Just wait. Yo, they're out in our B hall. Let's go. Oh. Be hall. Shit. Oh shit. Yeah, be hall. Oh, great. What? That was great. Let's try. All right, 12 to 6 here. It is almost over. Pier now with a very nice lead. And uh, this, uh, again, Gladiator right now is beating down x 3 0 like they stole something. I mean, he is single handedly uh, handling doing this, uh, just doing some work here. Uh, again, if uh, in the next map, x 3 is really going to have to try to contain Gladiator because this kid, he came to play tonight. Uh, let's take a look at Glad here, Mayday, as uh, I'm going to filter on over to him right now. As uh, there we go, as he's getting, oh, he gets taken out by Grim. So uh, I'm sorry, Gladiator, as I probably jinxed you there. Grim uh, takes him out with a 74. Uh, right now it is a 5v4 here. The one man advantage here going to x 3 0 as Insight has the bomb. Usually Mav has been having the or been the uh, bomb carrier or bomb bitch but uh, Insight now looks like he's going to overtake those duties here with the pump shotty. Uh, let's see what he can do here as he's trying to work the B area. Mav trying to get some shots from the uh, kitchen area of the B side. Oh there's oh, Deli feels the uh, shot action there from Insight. Mav taking out Limitless so it is Snatch and Coach here. The last two for Pierre. Insight now gets the plant down. Good job there. Let's see what Insight can do as 40 seconds are working against uh, Pierre here 2v3 one man advantage here going to x 3 0 I'm gonna take a look I'm gonna look for Apostle here as he's holding down the B along with Insight Grim takes out Coach so the last man standing here will be Snatch let's see what Snatch can do oh he gets taken out there by Grim 12 to 7 here as they extend it out at least a little bit more here on the first map here on MP Vacant 
Again, in case you just join us, you're watching EREV TV here, the Gottfrag Lower Bracket Finals here between X3O and Pure. So uh, right now it is 12 to 7. Uh, we have X3O, or excuse me, uh, Pure with a very commanding lead. As uh, right now, uh, looks like Limitless taking out Twister there. So it's going to be 4v4. So uh, as both teams settle, settle it up here, and Mav rotating. Actually, he's going from the outside back to B hallway. He's got inside. Oh, Limitless, nice long distance shot there on Mav. So the bomb is on the outside of the B entrance of the hallway uh, on that dumpster portion so uh, X3O is going to have to move it all the way back here and I don't think they care about the bomb they're going to go for the kills here as Grim is getting lit up here Grim right now uh, not doing anything uh, trying to move here he's going to go back to the bomb Limitless is the last man standing as uh, we're going to take a look at Limitless he's holding back here he's in between in the mid area here by file cabinets he's getting lit up he's not sure where and there's insight with the pump shotty 12 to 8 as they inch a little bit closer here we're going to go to war room Mayday. Where are we going to go? It's pure! Eric's. Okay. What's up? Bad day, bad day, bad day, it's us. Even One's fire. One's a couch. Scope bar. Fire. Scope. Ah, uh, one's a scope. Yeah, couch. Scope's up. Is that bar? Yeah, I got uh, courtyard side. Oh, ammo. I gotta chill. Oh, no. It's chill. Up. Three on one. He's all, the way, he's all the way back down the corner. He's got eight off. No way. He's gone up on the platform now. Thank God. Alright, that is it. 13 to 8 here as Pure has finished it up. Apostle almost clutching it up there. He had a couple of uh, members there, Delicious and, and uh, I believe it was uh, Limitless there to clean up that round. Couldn't quite get it done, but he did pick up a couple there before uh, Pierre put this to end, at least for the first map. Here we are once again to District, and I must say, this is, this is going to be interesting here to see who will come out on top, at least on this one. Uh, again, uh, I believe this is Pierre's choice, and I'm going to ask him uh, once I get settled here. But again, um, Pierre wins the first map, and again, the winner of this one takes on Pandemic. Again, I'm not sure when, as the schedule is just freaking all jacked up to hell. But nevertheless, it will be here on E-Rev, casted live and up close and personal, just like going to a strip joint. So, no money uh, accepted here, as it looks like um, we're getting things uh, settled here. As everybody's loading in, getting getting readied up here again. Starting lineups here, first for Pier. We have Snatch, Gladiator, Limitless, Deli, and Coach. And for X3O, we have Mav, Twista, Insight, Grim, and Apostle. As uh, we're going to get ready for the knife round. Uh, looks like uh, we're all ready here. So we're just waiting for Apostle to ready up. As uh, we'll do that, I'm gonna, as we get ready here, I'm going to take a quick drink of water here. Again, you can get your shots at pound a dash rev on the Game Surge Network. You can hit myself anger or just add a water. And uh, give me a moment here as we get ready for the knife round. So uh, stay tuned real quickly here. All right, here, I'm going to get some shots first from 90. Uh, this is from DEI. Dude, I fucking love the way you cast. It's so funny. All right, 90. I don't know how to take that. I guess that's a compliment, but I appreciate that, 90, for that. Uh, we have one here from Amped. Shout out, shout out to Pierre for beating everyone, and hi to my brother, Rames, or is that Ramos? Okay, Amped. I probably screwed that all up for you, my friend, but I apologize. We have one here from John Chisholm, Access Pro Halftime. Talk about the pro servers. Would you, bro? No problem. As, uh, again, one of our, uh, one of our, 
sponsors here that we have, again, is Axis Solutions. I mean, again, you could, you could visit them. Go to Idle them, perform them, and I'll get into the uh, servers in a little bit here. But make sure you go to Ax Pound, Axis Dash Pro on the Game Search Network and uh, make sure you idle them, perform them. Uh, I will love you for that. They will love you for that. And uh, you should love us for that. So make sure you do that. And don't forget, I don't perform pound e-rev as uh, we try to give back to the community. And it looks like, wow, Apostle cleans it up. Extra real will get side choice here as they get the, this situated. But uh, nevertheless, make sure you do that as, uh, again, if there's any news out there of people leaving teams as uh, everybody likes to do, it seems like, in this freaking game and can never keep track, uh, make sure you hit me up on that as I will try to get that out and over the airways. I love cheese may and Spanish. That's drama for all you English, Anglo-Saxons, people that don't know what cheese may is. Uh, but I love it as uh, I love to get that out there, especially any transactions between uh, members leaving teams. So it's all good. I'd like to try to get the news out to you, the people, the masses out there. And also, people, by you, the community out there, make sure you go to www.e-rev.tv, join our forums. If you, since Cal forums are down, try to get these forums uh, jacked up here. Try to get them working at e-rev. We allow any content, you guys can talk smack, as long as it doesn't get racial. I don't stand for racial crap, okay? That's one thing. But as long as you, uh, if you guys like to talk crap in other ways and stuff like that, go to our forums. We, we are not forum Nazis, at least except for the racial aspect but other than that we let it fly and as you know in the war rooms and the way we cast we're pretty free here so uh, that's the way we like to be and that's why we we like to keep our forum so make sure you guys populate that help us out as uh, we'll keep helping out the community also so again um, it looks like we're just getting ready here for one player and that is snatch and uh, we're waiting for him to ready up in the meantime I'll get over so I'll get some shout outs across the airwaves again all right, 90 always let me know. Yes, it was a compliment. So, uh, defied baby, okay. Uh, thank you, 90, for that compliment. We have one here from Todd. I like big, big titties. Todd, I would have to agree with you as long as she's not big, not round and fat. I love them too, especially silicone. Silicone is not a bad thing, young uh, kitties out there. If you guys are uh, 16, uh, 17, 18, as you get older, Silicone's always good for when you get married in your 30s, 40s. Make sure your wife gets that because once they have kids, it gets a little saggy, but that's okay. Uh, Dark, LOL. Shout out to Just Add Water. Thanks for being my sex slave. That is from Dark, as uh, he keeps changing his freaking name all the damn time. All right, uh, we're going to get things going here. <clears throat> right now, it looks like x will be on the defense. We have, uh, let's see who the bomb bitch is for uh, Pierre, and it will be delicious. So delicious here in the B house. Uh, let's see what he can do here as uh, he's going to try to work his way in there. He's taking his time. Grim and Snatch, the only two participants that are dead, make that Mav and Limitless now as they fall the, by the way of the gun. Delicious here, working very slow. I'm not sure. Oh, that's who he was looking for. It was Twister from the Cleaners here, picking up his dry cleaning and making a kill there as the bomb is on the outside of the B house here. Glad. Oh, Apostle. My God, Apostle is starting to warm up here, taking out Gladiator. So Coach, the last man standing here. Let's see what Coach can do. He picks up the bomb here and he gets taken out by twister twister ladies and gentlemen is alive and kicking one to zero here as x 3 takes the early round lead mayday where are we gonna go yes ladies and gentlemen it's x3 freaking oh yeah three middle Three in middle. Cool. He's just watching that. Yeah. Fuck me. Hey. He's got Rob's house. Coming for me on my yard. They're definitely going back to A, dog. Mm. Oh, there's a guy behind you. He went in your building, A building. Shh. Oh my 
goodness. Oh, he's... Nice try. If you had an MG, you could have killed about three of them. Alright, it is back now as a, as Pierre picks up that round. So it is all tied up here on District 1-1. One one. This is the second map of this possible uh, three maps here. This is the lower bracket finals for the Godfrag tournament. As my god, it seems like this dang tournament has been going on forever. But nevertheless, I'd like to thank Godfrag for putting this on. Uh, even though it's been going on a little long, it's been very entertaining, and I appreciate them giving us the opportunity to cast the matches here for this tournament. So again, big ups and thanks to Got Frag. And uh, if you don't know where to join them, then I can't help you, but it should be obvious. You can hit up Got Frag and where to go. As right now, Delicious popping off the smoke here. Again, like I've said before. Oh, looks like Delicious Explosive is going to get this down. Planted. Grim gets taken out there. And it's Insight picking up a double kill there on Snatch and Limitless. Again, Insight uh, doing some work along uh, with <laughs> Twister here. So uh, let's see what transpires from this as now it is uh, Twister and Insight. Now it's Insight by himself here. Insight at the flower pot takes out Delicious. Insight gets taken out by Coach. It is now 2-1. to one. Pure as uh, they try to extend this out here as we head to the fourth round. Let's go to Pierre's War Room, Mayday. Go back to the... Let's go down A. Jail, one jail. Maybe laundry now. Another one down A. Nice shot. Back here as Gladiator starts up his engine here. He is five and two. Uh, we have Limitless at four and two, and Delicious at three and two. Four x three, freaking oh. We have uh, Twister four and three. Insight coming in at three and three, and Grim needs to lift some more weights here because he's coming in at one and four. So he's gonna have to pump some more iron as uh, he's coming in at one and four. So uh, right now three to one here in the favor of Pure. As uh, things transpire, uh, as we look here, I'm going to take a look at Twister. Twister gets taken out by Glider. It seems like I jinx everybody when I go to look at them. They get killed pretty easily, so I'll try not to do it as much. As of right now, we have uh, Insight uh, taking out Limitless. So Insight, once again, by himself. I feel bad for the guy. And as uh, he's going to be fighting four members of Pierre, that would be Glad, Delicious, Snatch, and Coach. And Gladiator with the AK takes him out, and it is now uh, four to one. And I'm wondering if X3O is waving the white flag because it's kind of, mm, I don't want to say it's looking that way, but it, it makes me scratch my head and wonder here. Hum, scratch my head here. It makes me wonder. So uh, again, for the people out there, if you guys did, if you didn't catch the last match, I prefer, I, I put out a question for you peeps out there. If the Octomom did a porn. Would you guys watch it? Make sure you guys hit me up on IRC or put it in the channel as I'm looking in. Uh, would you watch it? As uh, I'm a pervert and I probably would. So, um, But that being said, I don't know about you, the peeps out there in the community. So just uh, let your your, uh, your message be felt. That's <laughs> my wife is yelling at me and looking at me all crazy. Like, why would I look at that mess? All right, it's 4-2 to two here as X3O picks up another round. All right, right now we're gonna head right back to X three O's war room. Let's go. Oh, top A. Got him. Jump down to mid. Oh, I hear one laundry. I think. Yeah, one top A. Yeah, one laundry. I'm pushing Taco. Got it. Insight usually plays cage, right? Mickey D's. One's uh, Broadway. Explosives One's planted. Mid One's mid market, one's mid. Mid market down. Alright, it is now 5 to 2 as Snatch clears that up.
Uh, as we head into the eighth round here, and wow, as I look into IRC, lo and behold, who do I see? TM. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, TM equals the man. This kid is a big teddy bear. So if I was to see him right now, I'd give him a great Flash big e hug and uh, really probably spoon him because this kid is a sexy beast. But anyways, as we get back to the match, look at all this smoke. And again, like I said before, Michael Phelps would love this scene right here and probably just really snip it all up. Uh, right now we have Insight taking out Gladiator. As of right now we have Freak. Wow, it, look at Freak there taking out Limitless and uh, Twisted doing some work there. So right now it's going to be three against two. The one man advantage going to X3O. As we have again, once again, Insight, Twister, and Mav going up against Delicious and Coach. Uh, let's take a look and see what these guys are at as Delicious takes out uh, Twister there and he has the bomb in his hand. The last man standing once again, as I've said many times, at least in this map, Insight is the last man standing. He is on the polar opposite side here of where everybody else is at so insight will be going against uh, delicious and coach uh, let's see here as delicious has the bomb still in the B site coach working the a cafe insight now knows coach is there coach is not gonna fall for the bait here oh actually he looks like he was uh, insight now backing off they didn't see one another coach now oh he, he didn't f there he goes coach taking out insight and uh, coach did not fall for the banana in the tailpipe uh, so good job there as Pierre picks up once again another round. So uh, let's take a look here at x 3 off the start or make, make that Pierre here as I'm going to look at Delicious as he has the bomb. He is bypassing the champagne room. I'm very disappointed in you Delicious as that's my favorite room on this whole map here as they have the couch, the stripper couch and tables in there. So, But nevertheless he's in the parking lot here, carpool area, however you want to call it, entering the A bomb site. Let's see if he can get this down. Smoke being deployed. As Delicious gives a little jingle jingle. Nothing going there. Uh, let's see what he can do. Try to get things rocking and rolling here. Things working out a little slow around the A-bomb site. Four members of X3O. Four members of Pierce. So it seems a table of eight. Here, uh, let's see what happens. Uh, there we go. Shots being fired. Nothing really, uh, no one dying yet. So everybody's still staying alive here as a positive is taken out by Coach there. Gladiator uh, gets uh, beaten down by Mav. Look at Delicious taking out Mav. So the last man standing, Twista, as now he's in the A arch. Oh, it takes out Limitless as Limitless was trying to be sneaky there. The bomb is planted here. 42 seconds working uh, against uh, Twister. Twister now has both weapons co rocked, cocked, and ready to rock. Let's see here as he jumps across the A arches, blindly shooting, giving away his position if Pierre didn't know already where he was here. As he's getting, oh, he's bleeding off a little bit here. He, if he gets more shots in him, my goodness, I don't know how much this kid can bleed as he's working his way to the A cafe. Twisted now. Let's see what he can do here. Has a clutch goggles on, going up against Coach and Delicious. Uh, Delicious in the V arches. Oh, he gets taken out there by Delicious. Delicious, good job there. Seven to two as we head into the uh, tenth round. As uh, once again, we're going to do some more room. Room. Uh, let's go to Pier. God, I'm gonna quit playing with the universal. Nice. Who'd you kill? I killed Man, I killed Man, I killed Man. You better stop AF, I'm tagging him up. I got him, I got one AF. Alright, that's not one him, just rotate I'm mad down. One's still A. One's still A. No. Oh, he's at uh, bricks going yellow car by cage. Hey, I'm wagging. You play plan B. Let's go plan, 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 plan B. Plan B. B. Watch my mid or my Mickey's. Explosives planted. All right, coach cleans that round up eight to two as uh, they're gonna extend this lead as we get close to halftime here as. <laughs> Twister trying to rename his <laughs> He's just going flatline here, I guess. Uh, Twister is. 
Oh my goodness, says Twister changes his name from Freak to Flatline, I guess, or Underscore. I'm not sure what he wants to call himself, but we'll just call him Flatline. Uh, Limitless takes him out there, so uh, the one, well, actually, the uh, big advantage here going to Pierre as uh, pretty much they've had this, uh, at least in the full of maps, in case you just joined this. Pierre won the first map. And uh, now it looks like they're underway of w winning the second one here. But again, I can't count on X3L as that wouldn't be professional. But uh, again, it's pretty much done. The women are gurgling. The, the fat lady is gurgling. And she doesn't have big boobies. So sorry, Todd, as... Um She's just a little undersized, but that's okay. As Grim and Mav are the last two standing here, going up against Glad and Pierre. So Glad now with the scope. So scopes being exchanged here in hands that you don't usually see. As uh, right now, Glad uh, trying to peek out. Oh, he takes out Mav. Mav just kind of worked his way into the uh, doorway there, and bang, he's dead. As Glider now, Snatch taking out Grim there, and Pierre now. It is nine to two as we are one round away from halftime. And uh, right now, uh, we'll see what goes on here. As I'm going to take a look at, uh, let's take a look at Pierre here. Let's see what Snatch does here. He's bypassing the bomb, but he's going to lead the, uh, the push here. As uh, he's going to try to get that smoke out right now. Snatch now. Oh, he gets taken out by Mav. Mav being the aggressor here, so let's take a look at Mav here. Oh, he gets picked up double kill on Limitless. Make that a third kill on Gladiator. Mav coming out of the gates very quickly there uh, with the MP5 rocking it. Uh, let's see what he can do here. Mav picking up his KDR, uh, looking juicy this round. Coach taking out the insight. So Mav right now, and Grim, and also Twista. Uh, going up against Delicious and Coach right now. So let's take a look. Delicious with the bomb here in my favorite room. It looks like he was going to enter the champagne room, but he doesn't. He teased me. Oh, there he goes. He's going in, and he gets killed on the outskirts there. Mav with the quad kill. Mav is juicy. This kid is hot right now. Let's see if he can clean it up here and get the last kill on Coach. Uh, Coach right now looks like he's backing off. He's at the A bomb site. He has a long way to go to get this bomb. He's going to really add to his frequent flyer miles there as Grim takes him out, puts him uh, out of his misery. 9-3 to three here as X3 freaking O picks up another round. And as uh, we head into halftime here, 9-3, to three, still in the favor of Pierre. And I'm not going to change my prediction. The fat lady is singing. And, uh, well, I'm going to get to some shout-outs here. Todd, yes, he loves huge titties. This, true that, skinny and big titties. So thank you, Todd, for that. As you uh, pretty much uh, solidified what you were saying there. We have one here from TMV. I guess that's from Crash. If it does go to a third map, I enjoy your casting, but I'd like to hear more War Room. Okay, since you're asking it. I will give it. We're going to go to War Room next round here as Mav gets the first, or actually he gets taken out there very quickly uh, from Glad. As, right, oh my god, Twister has changed his name to everything in the book here. Now he's Kato. I don't know if it's Kato Kalen, the OJ Simpson uh, case there, but uh, hopefully it's not. Uh, right now we have Insight taking out Glad here. And the last man standing once again is Insight, and he gets taken out by Limitless. It is now. 10 to 3, so we're going to go right back to War Room. Mayday, X3, freaking O. Let's go. This should be 3. Is this not the right rule set, bro? Uh, no, it's not much too. There's nothing you can do about it. Uh. Hold on, I'll get the ACOC guy. I got the bow. Uh, he's just gonna be sniping back of it. You saw him, saw him at the right char, dude. Mmm! Alright, 11 to 3 as it just inches a little bit closer here to the end of the line here for x 3 It is now 11 to 3 in the favor of Pierre. The defense here looking really shaky, and again, you got to give props to Pierre as they're just working it. And I'm going to take a look at X3O here. Let's see how they're going to push this. Mav is going to go along with the Grim. Uh, they're in the Champagne Room, so they're going to work the B. Uh, let's see here as uh, Limit, or excuse me, Twister takes out Glad. As uh, looks like they're going to be working. The bomb is down right now.
and there's Delhi with a double kill on Twister and Mav. So right now it looks like uh, I'm not sure who this is. It looks like it's going to be Apostle uh, as the O O O O uh, Apostle now with the uh, 74 uh, working. Looks like the A area. Insight now taking out Delicious and x will pick up another round 11 to 4 there as they didn't they just left the bomb in place so they're going to try to go with their uh, their killing uh, uh, experience here I guess you could say they left the bomb there I'm kind of surprised at that from X3O uh, but let's see what they can do here as they're going to work the A bomb site they're going on a full push here as X3O is working at now finally Mav is picking up the bomb here as Mav now is going to work the A site as uh, we have uh, looks like it's going to be uh, Apostle getting taken out there as the first kill Grim also uh, dead so it's going to be fi glad taking out inside here comes Mav now with the bomb he's going to rotate to B he's getting shot up from behind there as uh, right now it's going to be Mav all by his lonesome here going up against four members of Pier. This is not looking good here uh, for Mav and he gets taken out pretty easily there by Gladiator. 12 to 4 and we are getting close uh, ladies and gentlemen. So right now we'll do one more round or let's one more yeah one more round of uh, War Room here. Let's go to uh, Pier. Mayday let's go. More, more, more. Uh, B. Let's let him rotate. Hey, that guy could have rotated out. I think he did. Explosives planted. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Where's he at? Taco. Taco down. This guy's Mickey D. Nope. Lose it so they yell at him for leaving. Move truck. <laughs> Wow, look at Mav clutch it up there, taking out Coach and Snatch. Good job, Mav. 12 to 5 as it extends this out a little bit more here. As it looks like we dropped somebody. I think it is uh, Apostle that has dropped. So, uh, they said screw 5. <laughs> As they're going to go 5 before here in this last round. So this should be about it here. Hopefully Pier uh, can put this away. Again, it is 5 before. As it looks like one member of x has left. And I believe it is uh, Apostle. But it could be Twister as they changed their name. So I apologize on that portion. Uh, right now we're going to take a look at Limitless here. As he's working the Champagne Room. He gets taken out there by Insight. As he was just kicking back while getting the lap dance. Takes out uh, Limitless. So he has... Uh, Gladiator going one on B1 and gets inside and inside with a double kill there. <laughs> this, this is almost over. Oh my goodness here. Insight by himself. Uh, this is about over here. We're just waiting here as can Insight clutches. No, he can't. Delicious puts it away. 13 to 5. And that is your winner here. Pier uh, goes on to win and they will play Pandemic in the uh, Godfrag Finals. So again, uh, good good tournament uh, here for X3O, even though they went through some issues. Uh, but again, i got to give some love to X3O for at least finishing it out. Uh, much props to them. So that is pretty much done for X3O. As uh, I wish I had taps. Uh, we could play taps. I mean, we could play that for them as their team is pretty much dead. I'm not sure. I was talking to Grim, like I said before, and he said he just feels like quitting gaming. So he'll probably just go to bodybuilding and uh, pump up those steroids. So I'm not sure what's going to happen with Grim and the boys, though. But I hate to see them leave as, uh, again, they are good for the community. They're good for the game. Uh, so I hate to see uh, Grim and, and, and the... The rest of the guys from x leave Insight, uh, Mav, Apostle, Twista, and, and them. But I guess uh, things happen for a reason. So, again, uh, like if, if this is the last time for you guys, uh, Grim, which I don't think it will be. I'm sure you'll be back. But at least for the meantime, it was fun watching you guys. It was an honor casting you guys. So hopefully we'll have the opportunity once again. Now for Pierre.
They'll be taking on Pandemic. And Pierre is going to want, want some revenge, and they're going to want it in a big freaking way. So I can't wait for that one. Now, I don't have the date nor the time, but make sure you head to our website uh, and check when the current time and date will be. Now, if it's not going to be Thursday, uh, I'm not sure when it will be, but I'm hoping it might be Thursday so that uh, I'll have the opportunity to cast it. If not, if it's next week, that's okay. We'll have Wansom Just Add Water cast the finals. I will be in Miami next week. I'll be soaking up the sun, but I'll be there also for work. So if anybody lives in Miami that watches the uh, cast, uh, make sure you hit me up before I leave and we'll say hi or something. I'm going to be going to the, uh, hanging out there uh, on the beaches of uh, South Beach, so you guys can catch me out there with my rocking abs and uh, my, my my nice pectorals. Be uh, flashing them out there for you, the peeps out there in South Beach. All right. I have a few more shout-outs here. Uh, first, from Tech, uh, I would like to, I, I would like to look at the Octomom porn, but not to jerk it or anything, but like that. But one of those internet fads that everyone just has to see, kind of like the Paris Hilton sex tape. Yeah, I would have to agree with that a little bit there. We have one here from 99. Anger, can you watch two girls in one cup, baby, with me? Uh, that's a little freaky, 99. You're a little too freaky for me as I don't roll like that. Uh, but, hey, who knows? Uh, I may take you up on an offer sometime later. Uh, Mac Daddy, he wants me to tell everyone how much I love him. So, Mac Daddy, I can't say how much I love you because I don't know you. Uh, uh, so I don't want to pick up any kind of uh, STDs from you, but that's okay. I, I, I guess I can count you as I, I, I like you, I guess, not love you. All right, we have one here from Crash. Uh, he wants to say thank you and you, sir, good cast. Okay, thank you, Crash, for that. As uh, We have one here from Haste. Uh, don't forget, Haste is looking for a team. So Haste, I know Madcast is looking for somebody, so you may want to hook up with Moores on that, Haste. Uh, we have one here from Just Add Water. He wants to let the people know, if anybody plays COD 2, we will be casting it here. We will be casting the, uh, what is it called, the North American Cup for COD 2. It will be here at EREV. My man, Just Add Water. Uh, we have uh, also... I believe we're going to have F uh, Easton also casting it, and of course, Wansom. Now, if you don't know Easton, he used to cast COD 2 back in the days for, I believe it was COD Radio. So, I may be wrong on that, but he is, he is a sexy beast, has a sexy voice. So, once you hear him, you'll remember him, if you guys remember the old COD 2 days. He, he is here working for EREP, and uh, he'll be uh, rocking the COD 2 along with Counter-Strike. So, uh, uh, good uh, to have him here at EREP TV. <laughs> Zoles, you ever cast naked balls sticking to the chair? Yes, Zoles, that has happened to me a couple times. Uh, let's see, shout out, I support you, Anger. Thanks, Dark, for the support. As uh, that is all I have here. Uh, again, what a night. Pure beats X3O. Really no surprise there. Again, uh, X3O's roster was just pretty much turned upside down, but again, uh, they finished it out. They Pure wins two maps to zero, and they will play uh, Pandemic. Uh, coming up very, very soon, hopefully. Mayday, I'm not sure if you can talk right now, but uh, if you can, let me know. I'm not sure. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. Okay. All right, so he can't be, he's not able to talk, but nevertheless, uh, that is all I have here tonight as uh, Pure wins us. And until next time, adios. Apply directly to the forehead. E-Rev. Apply directly to the forehead. e is not responsible for any monitor to head-related injuries. Do at your own risk. e -Rev.